Hi, I'm Linda G. Come on and take a tour of the Thimble Islands with me. You will not believe this chain of 365 great big rocks just off the southeast coast of Brantford, Connecticut. 81 homes on 23 of them, and only six of those islands have electricity. The Thimble Islands were actually a gift. They were distributed to the descendants of Brantford. And these new landowners kind of capitalized on the legend of Captain Kidd because it was kind of hinted that he hid his treasure there. So of course, lots of people thought, hey, if I head on up to the Thimble Islands, maybe I'll cash in. Tourism was booming back in the 1850s, and then the Civil War came and kind of hurt tourism a bit. But by the time the war ended, this was the spot to get away from it all. But then September of 1938 came, and a hurricane destroyed many homes and killed seven people. Coupled by the Great Depression, Thimble Islands became a private community for those wealthy enough to afford to live here. Today, the Thimble Islands has seen a resurgence of tourism, and real estate seekers as well. So if you're looking to buy one of these properties, don't look at Horse Island because Yale University, they're not selling. It's part of their Peabody Museum of Natural History's ecological laboratory. However, maybe you can get a good deal on some granite for your kitchen countertops. There's a granite quarry there, neighboring Bear Island, that provided stone for Grant's tomb, the Lincoln Memorial, and the base of the Statue of Liberty. So there's your tour of the Thimble Islands, just north of us on the southeast coast of Branford, Connecticut.